My name is Adarsh Krishna. I'm from 8th grade. I study in Asia International Private School, Ruiz, Abu Dhabi, UAE. I'm participating in Cyber School's Digital Fest competition. And my project is a ping pong game using Python libraries. So let's get into the code. So this is the game. So when the game starts, the ball is going to ra uh, randomly choose a position to move to the white uh, side or to the red paddle side. And then it's going to start moving. It's going to be, be a bit quick. So the main goal of this game is always hit the uh, ball using your paddle and yeah, hope that your opponent does not hit. Yeah, so here uh, you can see when the uh, white misses, red gets a point. And in my game, what I've done is the first person to get 10 points wins the game. So you can see. Uh, I'll play red and like let uh, no, I'll uh, play white and let red lose and then you can see how it, uh, how it's gonna show uh -oh. and by the way I'm using the I'm like controlling the white paddle using my up arrow and down arrow keys while the red using my W and S oh my god I'm really not good at this game there you go and that should be the last point yes so you can see player uh, one has four uh, points and the player two has got 10 points the winner is player two so let's jump into the code so you can see here i've used uh, four uh, modules the tkinder random message box which you just saw the message box and then time so here in the starting here I'm, I'm making the board and then I'm line here you must have seen in the game this line and the circle so that code was for making the line this code is for making that white line so then we are moving into the class called ball so for the first function is to update the score so whenever the ball hits the side then the uh, score should be always updated and then when you go next uh, here i am uh, writing what what the score is how, and the default score 2 should be in the default where the ball should be on default before the game starts and then here i am writing the scoreboard like uh, how the scoreboard should be looking and then i am uh, writing and the speed of the ball when it hits a pad Paddle means the white and red moving rectangles. So this is a function. If the ball hits the first paddle, what should happen next? Where should it go? So that's this code. And then this is for same thing, but when the ball hits the paddle too, like the second pad. So here are the codes for the paddle one. Here I'm making the rectangle using you can see canvas or create rectangle. Here I'm uh, drawing the I mean like uh, putting it in the positions where it should be when the game starts and so this is for the controls here it's pal one so it's the red one I use W and S uh, buttons to move it so when I click W it should go how fast to the top side and how fast to the uh, bottom side of the board then uh, here um, it's about the paddle 2 the white one the same making of it the controls through watch like what can i control it then here the positions where it should be in the starting of the game then here you can see uh, it's the uh, you know as i said how fast it should go to the top side and the bottom side and then uh, the middle circle i said about the white line then this is a white circle and here i have given the colors for the paddle one paddle two and the ball uh, so the paddle one and two red and white respectively and the ball is yellow color then you can see this is an if statement to uh, find out who is the winner Here you can see it said ball dot score one is greater than the score of two that means the player one has won because score one is the scoreboard of the player one so and this is a message box where I've I had written game over player one has this much points and player two has this much points and the winner is who uh, and I forgot to show you where I created the ball. I have used 
a function like canvas or create oval to make the bowl and here i said where it starts i don't know i forgot where i wrote uh, where i wrote like i forgot to say how i made the bowl so now i'm gonna play the game one more time for you guys oh so this time i'm gonna let red win okay so why red let's win it's actually a more fun when you can play with your friend or family member who's there with you but now i'm alone so i'm gonna do both of them using my right and left hands so let's go let's begin the game Oh, I missed that. The paddle was too slow. And there you go. The game's over. So it's written. Player 1 has 10 points. And player 2 has 1 point. Really, I know I'm a good player. That's why he just got one point. Then the winner is player one. So that's the game. So bye.